what is going on youtube thanks for stopping by at v's life where you'll find some reviews kind of household stuff today we're going to do an unboxing and a review of the crkt uh onion helical edc folding knife uh, in all fairness i have had this knife for over three months um i have been using it so i want to do a little unboxing and then kind of a review of you know what I see, what I think it needs, and, and how much I like it. So right away, this is the box that it comes in. Um, looks like your ID number here is K500GXP. Uh, let's get that right. Let's see if I can get that right there for you. All right, so open it up. It come in this kind of a plastic little bag. Sit right there, and then in the box, you're going to get... Minimal, but you know how it goes. They got these kind of really cool drawings that they give you. How to win over an uncontacted Amazonian tribe. So you got a little instruction manual there on how to win over an Amazonian tribe, which is pretty cool, kind of interesting. So over to the knife uh, itself. Um, I really enjoy how thin it is. Uh, I like the footprint in the pocket. Uh, feels good in your hand. Feels weighted well. Um, let's go over just everything that I like about it first is how thin it is. I like this. Um, I like the opening mechanism. It's good. It's rough. It's nice. It sticks out just enough, but not too far. Um, knife itself is thick here. Let's get that open. That mechanism flew very nice. A little bit of finger pressure straight through. As you could tell, it is a little dirty. I have put it to good use um, pretty much all around the house. Um, everything that I've handled, everything I've thrown at it. Um, balance point is very nice. It's a good size all around together. Let's get you a measurement here. So open, you can see it's right around seven inches and closed, you're looking at around four inch closed, seven inches open. So nothing too big. Um, so far, I don't really have any complaints. There are just two things I think could be made better. One is the length of these, the little pocket grab, I feel like could be a bit longer. Um, I definitely like them being at least halfway or more feel like that gives you a better grab in the pocket and then my biggest gripe with this is the actual surface here is just too smooth i feel like the surface needs to be made rougher um so that it fits and stays in your hands better it's just a little bit too smooth and soft for me um i might come back later um and just do some stippling myself so that way i get a nice spot for my thumb and a nice spot back in here for my pointer finger. I like that. Um, in terms of the mechanism, I feel like it's just the right amount of power, just the right amount of pressure, and it does feel good. It is currently in my rotation, so I kind of work it through every day, depending on uh, how small I want that footprint to be. So overall, I do think it's worth it for the price. I mean, it's a great price point. It'll get you through your daily EDC and kind of handle your kind of typical small stuff that you go through every day. So let me get you an idea. Let me get you a shot of what it looks like in the pocket so you can get an idea of, you know, how far down this goes. Okay, so there you have it. Hope the uh, pocket shot makes sense and looks good. That is your review. Like I said, the, it, overall, it's a decent knife. It's a good EDC. Can get you through your basics every day. Hope you enjoy. I will put a link to everything down below. You guys stay safe out there.